Today on Horseland. You've got to be more careful, Mosey. The loss of her cat affects Sarah's judgment. Mosey! Leading her into danger. We gotta find her, Aztec. She can freeze out here. Mosey! Turning out to be another beautiful morning here at Horseland. Fall's just about done. Already getting that first sniff of winter in the air. It's an awfully nice time of year. Of course, it's a time of big changes, too. But I guess things are always changing. Some things just beginning. Others ready to end. Reminds me of another winter, not so long ago. And a frisky old cat by the name of Mosey. Now, old Mosey had been Sarah's pet for as long as either of them could remember. When Sarah was growing up, they spent a lot of time outdoors together. Mosey never was much of an indoor cat. They enjoyed milk together in the park. <laughs> they passed time together in the backyard. They touched the sky together. And together, they rode Scarlet for the first time. Wherever Sarah and Scarlet went, Mosey would come along too. So naturally, when Sarah began coming to Horseland, Mosey was right there. Only Mosey liked it so much, he never left. He took right to the life of a barn cat. He'd sleep up in the hay, and he'd look for Sarah between catnaps. There was a time when no self-respecting mouse would go anywhere near Mosey. Not if he knew what was good for him. But times had changed. Poor old Mosey could no longer hear or see so well. Yes, sir, old Mosey had seen better days. But through all the aches and pains, there was one thing he never lost. And that was his sense of humor. <laughs> Oh, it's you, Mosey. Morning, sunshine. Uh, not yet, Mosey. It's too cold to get up. Hey, <laughs> just doing my job. You want to sleep in? That's your business. Thanks, Mosey. I'll just sleep a little longer. Uh, till about uh, summer. Yep, Horseland was a happy place for old Mosey. But like I said, just as all things have a beginning, they also have an ending. Look out! <laughs> Mosey. What was all that about, Chap? You've got to be more careful, Mosey. You almost got hit by a car. Thanks, Chap. Guess I didn't hear it coming. Oh my gosh! Mosey, Chap, are you two okay? <laughs> You have to watch where you're going. We almost ran over you. Oh, poor Mosey. Works every time. Sarah loved that old cat, and that old cat loved her back. <laughs> Bonds like they had can't ever be broken. Man, I love winter. 
Why's that, Calypso? They give us extra food. You know, we have to keep our energy up. I can't stand cold weather. Oh, this isn't cold. Remember the blizzard we had a few years back? Now that was a cold winter. How cold was it, Jimber? Everyone nearly starved that winter, especially the wolves. They were everywhere. Right. There was no food in the mountains. They came here to Horseland looking for something to eat. You're kidding, right, Jimba? Afraid not. Ha! I'm not afraid of wolves. Well, I am. Um... Hey, Button, want to have some fun? Always. If a wolf messed with me, he'd be having his own teeth for breakfast. <laughs> What do you think you're doing here? Well, hello to you too, Angora. Haven't seen you around lately. Civilized cats don't hang out in the rafters of a bar. What's your business here, Mosey? Oh, not much. What are you... Uh, ah! <coughs> Just this. Thanks, Angora. Won't need it long. The nerve! When a wolf hasn't eaten for days, well, you don't want to cross paths with him. If a wolf comes near me, I'll kick him all the way into tomorrow. Chili, I still can't believe you're not afraid of wolves. They wouldn't dare mess with- Oh my gosh! Look out, Chili! It's a wolf! <laughs> It's just old Mosey having a little fun. Are you okay, Mosey? <laughs> fine, fine. Thought you weren't afraid of wolves, Chili. He's not. <laughs> He's afraid of cots. <laughs> <laughs> ha, real funny. I knew it was Mosey all along. Hey, sorry, Chili. Wouldn't love teasing you so much if I didn't love you. How would you like to get out and run, Scarlet Girl? <laughs> How about you, Mosey? You want to run too? You just want to be scratched, you silly old thing. Okay, have it your way. Come on, girl. You've been cooped up in that stall. Let's work the kinks out of those legs. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong, girl? <gasps> Mosey! <laughs> Mosey! Look out! I see. Well, we've done the best for him. We can. Warbida, Mosey. I wish Sarah and I could have gotten there in time. You tried, Scarlet. There was nothing you could do. Do you think, you know, he's gonna be all right? I'm no doctor, but he doesn't look good. Mosey can't leave us. He's part of our family. Just think how hard it's going to be for Sarah if Mosey, if he... Yeah, we know, Scarlet. Don't worry, Mosey. You're going to be okay. Because I'm not going to let anything happen to you. I give you my word. See? What did I tell you? Mosey's gonna be fine. It's too early to say, Sarah. I've done all I can do. We'll just have to wait and see. Winter's always a busy time around Horseland. Got to turn up the heater so the water doesn't freeze. And the farrier comes by to give the horses their winter shoes. Yes, sir. Winter means a lot of work and a lot of changes. What's that, Molly? It's a new blanket for Calypso. 
You're going to put nylon on her? Yeah, I was gonna. But it doesn't breathe. Since when do blankets breathe? That just means that it lets out the horse's body heat so they don't get too hot. Oh. Here, try this one. I have an extra. Thanks, Alma. Winter's never easy, but that one was harder than most in a lot of different ways. How's he looking, Dr. Martin? Not too good, I'm afraid. But he's getting better, right? Mosey's an old cat, dear. I don't think he's going to get better. You'd better prepare yourself for that, Sarah. No, Doc. You just don't know Mosey, that's all. He's gonna get better. You'll see. Sarah? What did Dr. Martin say? Oh, said it might take some more time. <laughs> That's all. Can we help? Maybe we can take turns staying with him, huh? Thanks, you two. But he's my responsibility. I told him he'd be okay, and I'm not going to let him down. I want to stay with him, okay, guys? Alone. Sure thing, Sarah. We understand. See me do a backflip? That I'd like to see. Okay. Here goes. Ta da! You still got it. Still the fastest backflip ever in Horseland. Wanna see it again? No, that's okay. Now, Mosey, tell me how you're really feeling. Well, sir, I'm feeling so good. I might take a little stroll, all by myself. Stroll, Mosey? Where to? Out there. Figure the night air would do me good. You sure you gotta do this? Would have gone a long time ago, but I couldn't let Sarah down. You two have been lucky to have each other. That we have. But it's time now. Uh, if I can do it. Here, lean on me. Thanks, Shep. But I can take it from here. Mosey? Didn't mean to wake you, Teeny. Where are you going? I'm uh, kind of tired of laying around. Thought I'd go off on a little vacation. Well, hey, can I go too? Sorry, not this time, friend. But if you go, who's gonna wake me in the mornings? Guess you're just gonna have to wake yourself. Take care, sweet girl. And you, Shep. I'll sure miss you. <coughs> Goodbye, you two. I don't think I like this. Nope, I sure don't. It's not our decision, Tina. Yeah! Yeah! Come on! Sarah! 
for a while. Hey, what's that? It's Mosey's footprints. But his trail's almost gone with all this snow coming down. Oh, Mosey, where are you? Mosey! She can freeze out here. Mosey! 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 <sighs> Poor Sarah. He's gone, Scarlet. And he's not coming back. Mosey, you can't do this to me. Sarah, come on. We gotta get back. I know. <laughs> oh, Mosey, I miss you. Sarah, how about a trail ride, huh? No thanks, Molly. Not today. Come on! You need to get up and do something. It'll take your mind off... You know, help you stop thinking about... Well... Him. Maybe some other time, okay? I'd kind of like to be alone. If you don't mind. Okay, Sarah. I don't mind. What is it, Alma? I was thinking. It was fun having two cats around here. And one of them, well, isn't exactly the friendliest thing you ever met. Hmm. I bet we could get Bailey to ask his mom and dad to get another barn cat for Horseland. What? See? The paper's full of ads for free kittens and stray cats. I don't think so, Alma. Come on, it's perfect. A new one to replace Mosey. Mosey can't be replaced, Alma. Oh, you know what I mean. Something to help you forget him. I don't want to forget him. How you holding up? Okay, I guess. Hmm. Okay's a start. But... Will, I really loved Mosey. I know. And I let him down. How do you figure? I told him he'd be fine. I gave him my word on it. Then you made a promise you couldn't keep. It wasn't your place to decide when it was Mosey's time. Mosey knew that. I want him back, Will. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Sarah. It'll get better with time. It really did Sarah some good, finally getting all those tears out. The days kept going by like they always do, and spring finally came back to Horseland like it always does. And with it came the promise of new life. Sunshine. Oh, everybody look! It's spring again! Oh boy, I can't wait to get outside. I'm gonna run and jump and play, and then I'm gonna run and jump and play some more. Yeah, anybody know how to open these things? <laughs> hey, Sarah. Yeah, Will? Could you help me with something? What is it, Will? This. Oh, he's so cute! Yeah, just born today. But we can't get him to nurse. Oh, what a sweetheart! Don't suppose you'd be willing to feed him till he can look out for himself? Are you kidding? I'd love to! Thanks. No, thank you, Will.
Did you see that? Sure did. You silly old thing. I know just what I'm gonna call you. I'm going to call you Little Mosey. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah took on the care of that piglet, and they were both a lot happier because of it. Day. I'll be with you in a few. All right, Sarah. Woohoo! Everything's going to be okay, isn't it, little guy? Bamano! Yeah! All Woo! right! It's good to have you back, Sarah. It's a new day, and it's looking good. Yes, sir. Life goes on. All things do have an ending, but in that ending, there's a beginning. <laughs>